Greetings guys, Cowman here, and welcome to episode number 19 of Minecraft Alpha to 1.17. That's right, one more video to go guys, and then we have made 100 videos here. So yeah, quite a landmark it's going to be. But first of all, we've actually got someone to add to the shout guy. In fact, we've got two people, but one of them is not going to be added in this video because I only like to add one person a video. Yeah, just so you know, there's always someone to add. So, so anyway, today we are adding Naz Cool Kid. Yeah, so that's because they left a comment saying, Hi, it's me. I haven't commented in a while, but I had to come back in time for the 100th. And also, they also said first, which... Like I saying first. Uh, yeah, they actually used to comment quite a lot on my old Minecraft series, actually, which I don't really do so much anymore. I might eventually return it, but not for a while, unfortunately. But yeah, I just felt like that was quite a nice comment, and, and therefore I think they deserve a place in the shout-out garden. So, thank you, Naz, for commenting like that, and welcome to the shout-out garden. So yeah, in the last video we were working on this thing, and, that's, and this is actually going to be like a, a huge sign that's going to say Alpha to 1.17 on it. So hopefully in this video, we're going to be able to finish it. So I'm just quickly going to get uh, the thing up on my screen. And yeah, let's go and work on it. So first what we are going to need to do, is we're actually going to need to expand this, this like whole sort of like cobblestone frame thing, and out onto an extra block actually, and like in that direction. And because m my design actually is basically going to have like, a sort of planky background, but I don't. But I also like want to have make have it sort of look like something on the back. So I want to ex extend it out a little bit. I'm mean, also going to need to finish a little bit of that off, actually. So yeah, let's get on with this then. So we need to put out one block, and then we're going to need to just expand all of this out for the full like you know like circumference of this thing well maybe for women to actually I think that might be a better way to describe it Ooh. nearly thought it was gonna fall there because you know it's a little bit laggy so anyway let's go let's go and get this done as fast as possible then so boom good yeah probably just do it you have to do and you like the extra layer on the top actually when we build that you know, that sort of gap. Yeah, the only reason the gap there is just because I ran out of materials in the last video. Right, so let's see how, how to best do this then. So nearly thought it's going to fall there because obviously I don't want that to happen because that's a bit irritating to have to swim slowly back up here right so nearly done the bottom bit so yeah let's keep going yeah by the way oh my god if I had not let go of the W key at the exact right time there that would have been me probably fall possibly falling to my doom in case you don't know what that thing is actually, that's my nether portal temple in there, and it's actually got a nether portal in there. I haven't really been to the nether so much actually recently, so yeah. Might need to do that maybe after the 100th episode at some point. Because actually, because on beta 1.8 was the update in which the hunger system was added, and you need lots more food in that version, I think we are going to soon, before we move on to that version, we are going to have 20 videos on beta 1.7, so it won't be too much of a big deal. I think Siri will need to go in there actually to get some more pork chops to eat. Yeah, just so I don't like starve because I wouldn't want that to happen. So let's keep going then. I'll probably just do this bit when you know, like on the way back actually. Oopsies! Quite a lot of close calls here, actually. Right, 
Right, so I think the best way to do this bit is probably going to be to get some water here and then sort of do it like this actually and basically just swim back up and then grab the water and then, you know, move on. There we go, good. So all we need to do now, uh, before this cobblestone frame is completed, just need to fill, need to fill in this gap here. Yeah, then we can actually move on. Yeah, so probably what we're going to do next is probably the, the planky background, and then we'll probably do this like the sign itself, like the lettering. Yes, and by the way, the lettering is actually all going to be made out of logs, actually. So, as much as I don't really like to do this so much, we might potentially have to go and get uh, some uh, some logs and uh, more, more, more trees, actually. Right, so let's see how much we're going to need anyway here. So I think this is nine blocks here. And um, just quickly going to check on what I've got on my screen. So this bit is nine by 63. So Alexa, what is nine times 63? So we're going to need 567. So Alexa, what is 567? Oh, hang on. Alexa, what is 567 divided by 64? I forgot. I can't say the, app. Any, any the operation there. Oh, didn't quite hear that. But, um, I'm going to quick try and work out myself. I think we're going to need maybe like, um, let's just make nine stacks then. I think that should be pretty much enough. So yeah, we are going to need a bit more inventory space, I can tell. I don't think we're going to need these feathers in all honesty, so let's just get rid of these. Let's just quickly prepare a complete row here. Right, so that's about three so far. Four. Five, six, seven, and, and a little bit more going to need, so let's put 32 in here. I'm not going to be able to fit all of them in though, so uh, yeah, that might be a little bit of an issue. So, there we go, good. Right, so, I don't think I'm going to need this string, so I can lose that in all honesty. We get rid of this water actually, just so this doesn't get in the way. I think that bit, we'll, you know, probably we'll, we will have like an extra block. So probably we're going to have the planks here, the letter in here, this bit's just going to be empty. So yeah, that'll be fine because I'm not going to build anything there. Right, so, finally, let's get on with this thing then. Yeah, by the way, the reason we're actually going with planks here is A, because, yeah, we it's quite an easy block to get, but B, because I really, really, really want this done in time for the 100th episode, so, yeah, do we have enough time to actually commit to getting something else, and damn it, I just realised I've done all this wrong. So, oh, great, actually. Yeah, it's supposed to go here, actually, not that bit. Yeah, like, unless I want it to point in that way, which, in all honesty... I kind of want to see it for my house bit, so, oopsies. Actually though, the way I've done this, it's actually been designed in a way that it can actually, I could also build like some lettering on the other side if I ever wanted. Basically I can just like expand this out, uh, and then uh, expand out the perimeter by an extra block, and then just build lettering on the other side, and then boom, perfect. Yeah, it's just, it's not really part of the main design right now. So, when we actually get all this done, let's try and do it properly. And because it's taking a little bit of a while, I will cut this bit out. So, yeah, I'll see you in a second. Okay, so welcome back. So, I've got rid of all of that stuff. So, finally, let's actually get onto the main in beef of the pie. This stuff. So, yeah, let's try and get this done as quickly as possible then.
So I think there might be a couple more stacks over there, so I will actually need to go and get those before they despawn. Just because there's one thing I really don't like, and that's items despawning. Especially when they're rare items. Oh, was there any over there? How many stacks is this we got here? We've got seven here. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I've got, I used one up actually, didn't I? How can I forget such basic things like that? Seriously, I'm such an idiot, aren't I? Right, so, keep going. Almost halfway through, actually, and when we finish this row, obviously. Not right now. Also, I really look forward when there's actually an option to turn the clouds, actually, just because they're getting a bit irritating here. No, honestly, that's actually one thing that ruined in my watchtower. Uh, which is like over in sheep planes in that direction, you will see it in the next video, uh, I promise, but uh, yeah, that's actually one thing that ruins it, because of the clouds, which basically obstructs your view a little bit. I can't even see here, seriously. Clouds suck, don't they? And you can't even turn them off in this version. So irritating, luckily. I mean, luckily they're gone now. So hopefully, you know, we might be able to live in peace and harmony without clouds for a little while. Possibly. So, more than half... I think I'm almost halfway through now. And after that, all we need to do is the lettering, and I can already tell. Uh, we're going to need to get some more wood first. So let's keep going that actually as quick as possible then. Also, do you think we can still have enough? Um I think so actually. I think this thing's only sixty three blocks, so yeah, I think we should have sufficient. Basically like that's one stack per row. So let's quickly just fill in that gap. Good. Thank goodness, actually, I did build this extra bit out here, actually. Otherwise, if I fell, that would possibly be me falling to my doom if I was in the wrong place. Like, basically, on that side where there's an island, and, you know, that could cause me, cause me to die. Which I would not like so much. You know, for obvious reasons. So I can get some zombies, so I think there might be some zombies on the roof actually. Luckily it doesn't really affect me because I'm not really going to be building on the roof. Right, ooh. Missed a bit as well. Uh, good. Luckily I successfully did that. What was that? Was that a zombie falling? Oh, I think it might be falling onto there, possibly. Luckily it can't really get me from right up here. Luckily, not too far left actually on this bit. Okay, let, maybe let's be a bit more careful here then. So good. Good and good. Maybe just build the two at a time because I think that actually is like, you know, the way to build the most mistake free way possible. Hmm. By the way, am I the first one to say that the most mistake free way possible? I know, it's probably enough of my bad puns, which I probably do make a little bit in these videos. Oh, let's try and, let's try and get through here then. So, good. And there we go. So, let's actually maybe start making, not making some of these letters then. So, obviously we're going to need A here. And probably we will do the torches after. Actually, you've, you've met idea there, I've just thought of. Let's do them now, actually, but what I will do first is 
make sure that they're all evenly spaced actually throughout the entire thing. So I think we'll also do them here. So let's space each one by three blocks throughout this whole thing then. So good. One, two, three, boom. One, two, three, boom. One, two, three, boom. One, two, three, boom. One, two, three. One, two, three, boom. 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 And one, two, three, boom. Perfect. Right, so let's see how much of the lettering we can do right now. Although I'm probably not going to end this video until I've done all of, the, all of these letters though. So yeah, if this video is a bit longer than usual, yeah, you'll probably know why. Yeah, like sometimes videos and go on longer, sometimes because of people rambling, but here, like, because I'm trying to get quite a lot done. Anyway, so I think here, according to my design, it needs to be four blocks spaced. So, yeah. And then I think here, I think this is three blocks up here. So, good. And then it goes all the way across here. Okay. And then up here, there's just one more block up here. And then quickly just go, and then they just merge here. So there we go, so that's one letter done already. Right, so, one done. How many more to go? So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, ten more figures. Will be it one of them is basically a screen, nothing other than a dot, you know, for point seventeen. Right, so here I think this bit is going to be four blocks for the L. Oh, and then the rest of it is quite simple, just straight up. I think also what I will need to do is I might need to light some of this up a little bit. So, you know what, let's do it now actually. And then we'll actually have to go down to the ground there just to get some more wood. Luckily though, there's that, you can now actually shift click hicking base 1.6. I don't really mention this too much. I might mention this maybe like in the early 90s. But uh, yeah, that's quite a useful feature. Previously, like, it was basically click, 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 click if you wanted to make things quickly. Right, so let's quickly light up the A as well on here. So, um, good. It's going to be enough light, probably. Right, so, let's quickly jump down then. Woo! Splash. What a satisfying splash there, is all I can say. Obviously, I'm not going to use any of that wood from that bridge, though. Yeah, for slightly obvious reasons, that is. Yeah, so I think we might actually use some from over here, actually. Just so you know, it's not like interfering too much. And I'm not going to bother with that tree because trees like that are a flipping nightmare to get rid of. Seriously. Yeah, you know, like previously, like, I think before this update, I think it was 1.6 when they nerfed the power of fire. Like previously, like, you could just set them on fire and then they'd be gone in a matter of seconds. Yeah, I believe that's gone now. Yeah, but like now, basically, because they take a really long time to burn, it's just irritating to get rid of them. That's why we don't really chop them. Yeah, I can see why they actually were removed for a while, actually, in the game. Quickly just deal with this guy. I don't really matter if he does blow up, because, you know, it's not really a place where I'm going to be building right now. Or at least in the near future. I probably will eventually be building here. Just maybe we might, I might try and expand a bit more that way. Right, so let's actually maybe get like two stacks here then, which will probably be enough, and which will probably be until this axe breaks. So yeah, just because this might be a little bit boring, I am going to cut the video here, just so you guys don't have to see me cutting down trees. So I'll be back in a second. Okay, so welcome back. So I've now got almost two stacks of wood, so that'll probably enough, only be enough in my opinion to get all the way across there. So yeah, without further ado, let's go and get back to work then. So obviously we need to get a P H A T O one dot not one seventeen done, and yeah, hopefully that sh we've got enough of that. 
Although it might be a little bit irritating due to the clouds. Actually, luckily, it does seem to be quite a cloudyless day. Yeah, like the nearest one's not not really that close. And also, I think I've got enough torches, so hopefully that won't be any of an issue. Mm, enough of an issue to bug me. Right, so let's get going up up here then. We should have built maybe like a ladder here, but yeah, when I built this thing, it was kind of designed like when it was kind of designed when like I thought it was only be three blocks this thing. Before I came with the idea to expand it out. Right, so got right, so we've got L done, so we need to now do P then. So I think here just look at my picture, I think this thing is gonna be three blocks high here. And then I think here it's also three blocks out here. Good. Then two blocks here. And uh, then all the way just straight in. And Perfect. And let's have some torches here, 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 and some here. Might have some on the bottom. I don't really need some on the bottom though. I was actually thinking whether to put them on the bottom, but yeah, in all honesty, it's a bit useless in all honesty because I've got quite a lot of torches here. Right, so now we need to do H. So, uh, I think that's quite simple. I think it's only four. Need need four, need four blocks wide overall, so just need to do it like um, I think it's like this. I think it should be exactly halfway. No, not half halfway, half halfway. Sorry. What was I what was I thinking there? Halfway. It's half. Like the L is silent. What am I thinking? Right, so it's quite simple. So two blocks out here, and then like one just simple, you know, line straight down. Right, so and perfect. Well, then he fell down there, which I don't want, obviously. Right, so now we need to do another A. So I think just need to build it in the exact same way that we built it over there. So I think it's spaced by four blocks here, these two sort of like... I'm not exactly sure how to describe them. I'm just going to say like, launching sections. Yeah, I know, maybe that's like a bit of a bad way to describe them though. Right, so there we go, it's four blocks here. So, I think here it's three blocks here, so one, one two, three, and then it goes all the way across here. And then after that, it basically just simply merges. So, perfect. So I think here, yeah, I think the gap here is like three blocks, so I think you start here, the T. Uh, I think then it's just two blocks here. Plus two more on this direction. And then just straight down here. And then I think it's just pretty much done this bit. Let's quickly go into third person actually, just see if it looks good at all. Uh, yep, yeah, looks pretty decent. So I think here this bit, the O is going to be pretty simple. I think it just needs to be straight down here. And I think here, I think it's four blocks according to what I, I, I wrote yesterday. Yeah, I'm actually recording this the day after I recorded episode 98, by the way. Ooh, not like that, though. Ooh, seriously, not like that. Uh, let's get rid of those two blocks there. Right, so, there we go, perfect. 
So I think after that, it's then spaced by three blocks again. Uh, let me just check that. Yep. So it starts uh, one, two, three. Right here. Here the one starts. And then this just goes straight up here. And then basically has sort of like one curl there. So the dot, simples, and then we just need to do another one, exactly the same way as we did that one. Yeah, I know like eventually like we'll probably move further than 1.17 eventually, but in all honesty I think I'm going to have to just keep series as 1.17, it's a bit of a brand name in all honesty at this rate. Not like officially a brand name, but like de facto. Ooh, we do we need to fill in a teeny bit here, I've just realised. So, uh, let's quickly fill this one block in there. Good. And then one thing, the last thing we are going to need to do before we can officially declare this thing complete, is we're going to need to add some torches to the whole thing. So, right, there we go, so, now let's actually quickly just add a couple of torches here, I think then it'll be fine. Uh, I don't think we need one here, just because it's pretty close in all honesty. And uh, not, probably not going to need one there. Or so maybe like, uh, like, sort of like the corner bit. Uh, like that, perfect. Not going to need one on the dock, probably. Oopsies, nearly fell down there. So there we go. Oh, except the clouds are coming in. How typical is that? Yeah, like, I know I live in Britain, but why do we need British sort of weather now in Minecraft? Like, clouds, clouds. Luckily not rain. Oh, hang on. There's a block that we don't need here, though. So let's actually just get rid of that bit. Uh, there we go. Perfect. And here. Uh, let's just have one that's sort of like the infecting bit. Good. Uh, if I can get that torch. Yeah, nearly across now. So let's just have two there. Like, sort of like at the intersecting bits. And maybe like just two more on top here. So that's good. Uh, I think here, let's just have them on these intersecting bits again. And I think that's actually pretty much perfect. So, let's make sure there's no dirt here. Yeah, I think what we will do actually to end this video is I might actually quickly go up, up the, up the uh, Sugarcane Observatory. And yeah, we'll see what this looks like actually from up there. Although obviously not before, I'm getting rid of all traces that I've ever been up here. Well, other than for construction that is. I think what I might do, actually never mind, what I actually said I was going, or said what I was going to do, they like sort of like leave it like a little bit underground so I, like, e e I can easily pile back up to this thing, but in all honesty I'm probably not going to need to do that and also this is in the wrong place anyway. So let's quickly get rid of this sand column then. Quite satisfying actually when you just see all the sand falling like this. Yeah, same thing with concrete powder, powder or gravel. Right, so, there we go, so that's that, oh, uh, I think that's the sign complete now. So yeah, let's actually finally go up here then, because I like it up here anyway, because it, it provides like a really good view of the whole world. Yeah, albeit they're only limited by a draw distance. So 
So we'll see the public entrance is that way. That's basically just the entrance to like the shoe cane part. So yeah, let's actually quickly go up here then. Ah, uh, look at that. So, Alpha to 1.17. Hmm, looks pretty decent, doesn't it? I think maybe, like, it would have looked a bit better if there were birch planks in the game, because then, like, it's a bit more, like, of a contrast. Maybe I should use spruce planks, actually. Oh, well, but I kind of, like, sort of, like, like to have, like, sort of alpha palette. So, um, yeah. But anyway, that is going to be in this video. The next video is going to be my 100th video, so definitely stay tuned for that. But for now, thank you all so much for watching this video, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.